Hello. Welcome back, everyone. This is Tim. Yep, we're trying to get the streaming on. Hey, this is Tim. All right. So I told you I would tell you how to do a check-in group. All right. So a checking in group is something that I started um, over a year ago to do checking in groups on the work floor with the teams. And I usually did it in the morning as kind of a let's get settled into work or a checkout after work to get ready to go home. But you can usually do it any time. And especially since we have more time to do check ins throughout the day now, this is how it looks. So in order to do a check-in, one of the things you're going to say, hi, my name's Tim, and go around and ask everybody what their name is. So you could do kind of a getting to know you game exercise with using your name. So have you used this one before? So hi, my name is Tim, and I'm carrying a tiger on vacation with me. So they call me Tiger Tim. And then you go to somebody named Tiffany. Hey, Tiffany, Tim's taking a tiger on vacation. What are you taking? So Tiffany is taking um, her aunt or somebody. So she would say, I'm taking an aunt. Tim's taking a tiger, and I'm Tiffany taking an aunt. And then it would go to, uh, let's say, Della. Della, who are you taking? So Della, I'm taking my kids. So Tim is taking a tiger, Tiffany is taking an ant, and Della is taking her kids. So you could play a game like that. So really you want to get to know who the participants are in the group and just do a name check-in. You can do it simple or later. Now the next thing is I ask everybody, tell me something different about today that's, that you can think of today. So today, today is... Monday. All right. Is it morning, afternoon, or evening? Today is it's afternoon. Is the weather outside windy, sunny, cold? So the weather outside is windy. Somebody else says the weather outside is cold. All right. So what day of the week it is? It's Tuesday. What date is it? Well, it's the 13th. What month is it? April. What is April known for? April showers brings Maine flowers. All right. So what rhymes with April? Maple. Maple rhymes with April. So again, we're trying to talk about today. What's going on today? So let's do a check in. So today is Tuesday, April 13th, and it's around two o'clock in the afternoon. All right, and my name is Tim, and we have Tiffany and Della and whoever else happens to be there in the group, if that makes sense. All right, and before I would pass around. Now, if you get somebody that's on a Zoom meeting and you're doing like a staff meeting or something, you could actually pick something up. I've got something here. Let's say I've got this giant ball. This is a gel morph ball that if you squeeze it it changes colors so I might pass this around virtually I'm gonna pass this around somebody take it somebody else take it somebody else take it and they could have a ball or a stick or something else and then it gets back to me up oh, there I go so we're passing the ball around and then you know when it's the ball time you can say and somebody could get a piece of paper, a pencil, or anything, and just anything you show up, or you could just have a virtual ball. All right, so I'm going to throw a virtual ball. Catch it! Or catch it. All right, so if you're in person, you would just pass it around, and you'd go slowly until people got it, and then you'd pass it a little quicker. So you just want to have attention. So anything that you can do that's going to be like an attention game, you could say, hey, Timothy, Della, um, Myrtle. I don't know anybody named Myrtle. I know a Myrtle Beach. So uh, again, you want to engage the people in something that's having them catch the other person's attention 
or an object or something. And so obviously for virtual online, we all don't have the same ball. Um, good idea was to everybody to bring the stress balls that I have in my office, the Centero stress balls with me and everybody have one. And then we could pass this virtual stress balls around. That would have been a good idea had we thought about that before we got to notice, which I got over the weekend, that I had to do it from home, so I couldn't go in to get my stress ball. How about you? What couldn't you go into the office for? <laughs> so again, checking in, look at the day, everything that you can describe about the day, uh, the temperature, the time of day, what day of the week it is, what hour it is, um, you know, what's the actual date, what month is it in? Is it fall, winter, spring, or summer? Although it's spring, it kind of feels like winter um, breeze. Um, are there, what specifically about April that's happened? What is a, a holiday in April? Well, Easter, right? And then we could say, what do you do for Easter? What did you have for Easter? And kind of things like that. So I, I want everybody to show, I'm sorry that this is what you can do, all right? So again, it's just checking in, it's using the day, the time, uh, some kind of activity to get you motivated and excited. And it can happen um, virtually or not, but just get yourself movement, all right? So that is what I'm cheering about the check-in group. All right, so I hope that you try it or that you use it at your next meeting or when you're checking in with a participant or checking in with staff or checking in at home. This is a great group that if you've got social distancing, you could do it from six feet apart. If you're in Florida, do it the length of an alligator apart, as they said. Um, so it's something that, especially now, it, it's really good to ground us into what's going on today in the moment. And for us to be grounded, like some of us forget the days blend together. We don't know if it's Monday or Friday or Wednesday or Thursday. We don't know what time of day it is. We don't know what the date is because we're, we're so trapped in doing the same thing over and over or being at home that we lose track of things. So I'll leave this with the fact that it's a good way to be grounded in today and to think about today and to really do a check-in with you, all right? So now I'm gonna go offline for a while, but I'm going to post a music challenge, all right? So it's show tunes with either a musical or a movie, and then you will get a chance to figure out which one it is and kind of play the game on your own, all right? I wasn't quite ready to do the live version of that yet, but I might do that in the future if I get requests. All right, so hope that you're doing well. Check in game, check in activity, try it. Hope you like it. Let me know. All right, take care. Bye. Okay.